Iran's Supreme Leader Ayatollah Ali Khamenei has called on Muslim states with political ties to Israel to sever them for a limited time. Khamenei lashed out at Israel and the U.S. during an inspection of the Iran Revolutionary Guard Aerospace Force Center in Tehran during the launch of the Fatah II warhead. Weeks before this, Khamenei had called for an Islamic oil and food embargo on Israel. However, other Muslim states did not agree to this at a joint summit between members of the Organization for Islamic Cooperation and the Arab League. Meanwhile, on Sunday, Iran's Revolutionary Guards Corps Aerospace Force unveiled a hypersonic missile named Fatah II. Iran has developed this missile despite numerous sanctions from the West. Iran unveiled what it said was its first domestically made hypersonic ballistic missile. Now, according to reports citing officials, the Fatah II has a supposed range of 1,400 kilometers. The report further added that the updated version of the missile can reach speeds uh, to match 520, which is 6,170 to 24,700 kilometers per hour. The latest version of Fatah contains a hypersonic glide vehicle warhead that supposedly supports the weapon's reaching maximum speed. The first version, Fatah 1, was unveiled in June of 2023. During the unveiling of this weapon, Iran also sent warnings to the United States and Israel. Iran claims the Fatah 2 hypersonic weapon has the capacity to bypass the most advanced anti-ballistic missile systems of the United States and Israel.